protect me. Welcome back to Weasel TV. You join us in the middle of a typhoon. It's green E36 back in the workshop. Um, time is a bit against us. We have some events we want to take us to. Dory Fest this year. Some more goodies that we need to install today. A nice little uh, high drive for them. <laughs> and these little uh, wasting seat. Keep us nice and secure. And the steering wheel because uh, the current one is uh, my, part of my French, a little bit. <laughs> Let's go! Yeah. Six, six, six. <laughs> oh, oh, hey, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't yeah. oh, oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. That's why you don't buy cheap steering wheels, eh? Oh. Yeah. Show me again. Wow. Yeah. That's the how often do you we'll, just, we'll just fix it quickly. How often do you work out, Gov? I'm pretty enough. impressed and strong. <laughs> oh, Come on! Gavin wrestling with his seat. <laughs> We're going to change the colour. What colour shall we dye it? Yeah, let us know in the comments. We're going to dye this. We're not going to spend any money on this. Cheapo build. Cheapo squad. But for now, we will rip this out, rip this out. I think we're going to put a hydro in here. I think. Um, we need to have a conference about that, don't we, Scott? Yeah, let's get a conference call on the way. Right. Ding, 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 ding. For the people watching at home, why have you taken the carpet out? We've got to watch and see. Uh... Looks brand new, mate. How's it feel? Oh, it feels good. So, and we've got a, we've got a little a slider on here. We've got it. We're going to try and retrofit this in there. <laughs> so we're going with. A nice Whittlewood cylinder with a separate reservoir so we don't have to have it going through the brake pedal because that makes it feel like Good Google it. Playing a jigsaw puzzle here, mate. I'm a tie brother. Years of being a child playing off. Mmm. 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 <laughs> E36 is quite notorious for having the seats off centre from the steering wheel, so we're trying to get the seat mounting position as close to the gearbox tunnel as possible. <laughs> The problem we have now is that this is going to hit the uh, center console, isn't it? But that's pretty centralated. Yeah, I don't think. I think we're just going to have to deal with a little bit of contact here. It still needs to go that way. But yeah. We haven't even got off the interior in, and it still won't even fit with it in. What am I talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're going to try bow it in then. No, no. Yeah, this is the worst bit. Yeah, I know. You know, you know how bad. Oh, right, I know. You know how bad this the is. The pain, the misery. You, you see this thing? No, that's cool. Yeah, Mish brought us this from Japan. The Oculus, nice view and car life. 
sick, mate. Don't know what it does. A wild gap in his natural habitat. It's like a drill swimming, man. It's too many beans. Alright, the seat is in. <laughs> Terribly. <laughs> um, we're doing some bodgery. Gav's doing some cards. Some cards, some, some cable aided, aided design. What? Say it yeah. again, <laughs> some cardboard aided design. <laughs> um, you speak Gavish? Ah, uh, Gavish. Yeah, that's cramping me out. Yeah. That's there's children watching. Alright, so we've got to make a box. For the hydro to sit on. So we can do some Yankee doodars. Present the whole car trilogist. Brad, Brad, Ted, Ted, Ted. Has arrived. It's my second job. Alright, alright. Just take a few chunks out of this metal and we've created this lovely, uh, lovely shenanigan. All your fab work, hit us up. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go it's check it works. He's not, it's not affiliated with the garage. <laughs> <laughs> what have we got going on, Chat Lord? We need a hot glue gun. The, uh, these bolts and Mr. Beige. It's stub work. I'm, I'm a stud, stud mate. <laughs> <laughs> to take to install a hydro. Bare. Bare blokes. <laughs> right, we've just welded in the bracket and now we have to fit these lines courtesy of Andrew. Thank you Andrew. Thanks for crashing your car Andrew. We've got two, we've got two calipers in here. Oh, there's one. There's two. Two calipers. Maths, mate. I don't think this is going to work. Is it coming out? No, you can't see it, but there's a hard sheath inside this thing here, which means it doesn't thread in. So we're going to have to make a little piggyback line so that we can then attach this further on and it doesn't have the caliper to trade in on interference problems we are currently experiencing, sir. There's also a hard sheath in my pants. <laughs> <laughs> So, we're waiting for some stuff upstairs to dry. We have chopped the money box out previously. Um, so, now we're gonna use 15 pieces of this weirdly bent pipe down here to glue it back together. Invaluable 
tool in the workshop. <laughs> Exhaust, hot glue gun, even Roger had a go. Roger. Roger. What now? Attache. <laughs> <laughs> and there's some uh, some lines yeah, for the. Need, need to make up something to attach on the end of this Jimmy boy. Oh, yes, I see the little Jimmy boy. Oh, the wang dangler. Yeah, the wang dangler, brother. <laughs> you seen Gav's nice drawing? Yeah, it's an artist. Well. Yeah, he's got flames on the tyres. <laughs> <laughs> That's unreal. Oh, we got some greenery growing. We're here. It's now daylight. We have the same clothes on that we had yesterday. And uh, we're ready to go for the inaugural exhaust test. Does it still sound like a tractor? Oh my god. <laughs> you got it. Got a nicely painted bracket now. Does it fit? Uh, a little bit of hand angling. Nice. It only goes to here. We've done a bit of the trim work. We're getting this nearly done. Got some button holes to cut out, some little bits to sew out. Yeah, it's, it's quite a clean setup, isn't it? Obviously, it's, it's hard. As we could it's, get. it's hard to hide this under here. Like we've done mine, it hasn't got a reservoir on it, so we kind of hid it back here. But I think that looks pretty smart. We've done the best that we can with uh, what we had, and since we've ripped off the old, uh, terrible steering wheel, a stronger replacement. So. We're going to bolt this on. It's an interesting looking Allen key, mate. Just colour it in. Does it feel like it's going to rip off or does it feel strong? Feels stronger. Yeah? yeah. Does the seating position feel good? Can you see over the steering wheel? Yeah, she's a little low, I will say. Uh, yeah, I, can, I, I did think that, but you kind of want your steering wheel set up high anyway. Yeah, back onto the high dry, and then uh, we'll catch you on the flip side. Does <sighs> <sighs> that feel right now? It's because the nuts and the bolts are the imperial ones, and we've got the metric ones, and because the high dry won't go in from that lovely analogy of nuts and bolts. What he um, said. <laughs> we're going to have to come back once we've went to the interwebs and ordered some uh, nuts and bolts for the bolts and nuts and the unions and Mate, that. you're hurting my face. Yeah, I'm yeah. sure you're hurting their face as well. How many times have you been to health with today? Three times. We're at a brick wall now, so that's gonna conclude this video. Hopefully in the next one we'll have the hydro put together. Do we actually, ridden some are we gonna drive this car ever? Hopefully, yeah. I think it's gonna become apparent that this little mistress isn't gonna be up to the job, so. We've got a three litre sat at the back, which we could put in, M54. A lot of space in. Misha was saying about a Saab lump, but we're poor, so. Hmm. Yeah, hopefully in the next video I'll be ripping some skids. Soda's out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Bye. That's all, folks. Yeah, the big